guys, um, a short video just to tell you about one thing that I've observed studying original swords in museums and um, private collections. And that is that um, many medieval swords, especially the types with what we call a wheel pommel, i.e. a round a circular pommel like that, the pommels are not always solid. Okay, So if you look at replica modern swords, they're pretty much, unless you go to really top end uh, uh, craftsmen for your swords, they're usually solid. And um, really that gives people the impression sometimes that medieval sword pommels are heavier than they necessarily are because many of these were actually hollow. Not entirely hollow, but partially hollow. So how many of them were made is they actually have a solid disc in the centre, which is the pommel, the true pommel, and then these raised um, sort of sections in the middle uh, were actually um, sheet steel forged into that shape and then brazed around the edge. Brazed is using brass to essentially glue the, the pieces of steel together, um, with heat of course. Um, brazed the sheet steel hollow plates on the front. So um, if you're looking at uh, medieval swords in museums and you see ones with particularly massive pommels and particularly in the 14th century, uh, wheel pommels seem to have got really big uh, on many swords. Many of them are hollow and you can see because very often they're rusted through because the sheet at the front is thinner than the solid pommel would be. They, you get rust holes through and you can shine a light inside and see that they're actually hollow. So uh, that's it really, just to say that when you're looking at these massive pommels, don't always assume that they're solid um, because sometimes they're very largely hollow and sometimes they don't give as much uh, counterbalance as you would assume that they do. And you pick up these swords, these original swords sometimes and you find, wow, actually that's actually got a lot of weight in the blade and the reason is because it hasn't got much weight in the pommel. Okay, so just an interesting little nugget for you. Thanks.